。数百名活动人士聚集喺美国首都华盛顿抗议大企业嘅贪婪，以及系贫富不均。佢哋加入咗上个月喺纽约开始嘅示威活动。纽约嘅抗议活动目前已经扩散到美国数个主要城市，活动人士聚集喺华盛顿嘅自由广场，然后游行前往白宫。示威者嘅一系列要求包括实行经济改革，以及系停止干涉外国冲突。华盛顿嘅活动人士响响应占领华尔街运动，而示威活动九月十七号开始嘅时候规模比较少，后嚟得到咗工会嘅支持。美国其他城市亦都举行咗小型反华尔街示威。好多示威者表示愤怒，佢哋认为百分之一嘅美国人占据咗国家嘅财产以及权力，而反华尔街游行嘅一个口号就系、是、我哋只系剩翻百分之九十九。美国总统奥巴马响一个新闻发布会上边提到咗呢次嘅示威。I think it expresses the frustrations that the American people feel. I've been to Occupy Wall Street, Occupy Boston, Occupy Maine, and now DC. Do you think there's a, a similar theme among all of them? Yes. What's that?、Um, to show Americans what a transparent government is like. What, in your opinion, is a transparent government? It's where nobody's bought or sold. Everything is completely open. There's no secrets. There's no governmental behemoth agencies. What do you think? How do you think government agencies are being bought, as you say? Well, 94% of、uh, elected officials get have the most money, and they get that money from corporations. So, you know, they're going to implement the policies of those corporations, and not what benefits us, the 99%. Which is totally legal, actually. Do you think there's just something? Do you think something should be done about Citizens United and corporate? Yeah, it should end end corporate personhood. Why, is, why do you think that? I think corporations aren't people. People are meant to expire. Corporations don't, so they just accumulate wealth and power, and you can't do anything to stop it or regulate it because they have the same rights as people. I don't think Occupy DC has a, a mission exactly. It's more of a common understanding that systems in this country of inequality can't continue, and that the systems that Support that level of inequality、um, need to be radically changed or addressed. So that there is not a consensus on how that is done. There is not a consensus on even specific demands that need to be made at this point. I mean, especially in D.C., it's a very nascent movement, and we're figuring each other out, and we're building momentum, and we're getting more people to talk politically with each other and to figure out what concerns they have. But there is not a unified. Statement of purpose necessarily. Why I came out in the first place, I guess, is is because things have been bad for so many people, economically speaking, in America for so long, and nothing really seems to be changing. So, demanding change seems to be a good way to start that. Explain that 99 percent, one percent. All right. Well, the one percent is 400 is 400 families apparently of these big uh, bankers, uh, J- um, J.P. Morgan, Wall Street, stuff like that. And you know, I think everybody should be fairly taxed. I mean, yeah, if you, if you work your tail off your whole life, you know, then by all means, you are obligated to have that money. You are obligated to be successful. You know, we're not asking that everybody just up and quits their job and gives us all their money.、Um, but the 99% is basically everybody else in this world that is having to is, that is having to deal with what the government is doing. And I think it's a little messed up how the government has to deal with financial. You know, or all these big、uh, corporations technically own them, and they're treating these corporations as people, which doesn't seem right. I understand big corporations are important by all means, but it just seems a little odd to me how it's working out like that.